I call myself a student, and I mean, and I'm not, it's not false modesty, of photojournalism, political cartooning, poetry, and prose, and I don't have any specific writing objectives instead of trying to wade through this unbelievably voluminous uh, New York article, New York Project, uh, 1619 Project. Yeah. Like, where do I start mm -hmm. so much, you know? Yes. But uh, one thing I want to do is get another passport for the fourth, first time in 40 years since I didn't use the two I had before and actually do something, go somewhere, you know, even if I have to stow away. Because <laughs> that's probably the reason I didn't, didn't, uh, Use it, you know. Use them, but uh, um, I don't. Like I said, I don't have any specific literary objectives for the year. But uh, so I'm not going to say I'm going to do this and do this and do that and and not do it. I'm going to play it by ear. The first thing that that monumental task that the professor gave us is I didn't even want to look at it until I look with Tony Morris because it's too much. It's too much in Tony Morris and. And then they go on and thinking about 1619 before we get through with Tony Morrison. For me, that's impossible. Mm -hmm. We're doing Morrison on uh, October, something called Great Word. Yeah. <clears throat> so <clears throat> that's basically where I am in a nutshell. It's not, no long, drawn out plans for the future. <laughs>